everyone welcome to another video and for today i will be talking about avon one of avon's fragrances and that's gonna be emery seductions you might have heard about avon's original emery already as it's one of their classics especially if you're an avon user but this one is their flunker this one is a different version they do have um, several emery versions now newer versions now and i have one of it two of those actually but right now i will be talking about one and that is gonna be emery seduction so this is how it looks like so i like their 50 ml bottle which i believe most avon fragrances comes with this size which for me is enough i like how handy it is it's sleek it's slim and easy to slip in your purse easy to travel with so i actually love the size also the color in there it's giving me more of the um, name is self seduction so the color is giving me an idea of more of a dark uh, mysterious scent so i first come across with this perfume in their brochure so most, sometimes in their brochure they put a sample there um, with their fragrances where you just actually rub your wrist in the picture of the fragrance and you could actually smell the scent of that perfume amazing right so i've done that um that time um they feature this one the emery seduction so i got a chance to sniff a little bit of the scent and i actually love it um right away because i thought like it's this is quite different than the rest of their avon um fragrances i mean that time because i haven't really smelled all the avon fragrances but i feel like um it's quite different than what i have smelled especially from the original emery this one is more of this like an ex there's like an exciting scent in there Quite fruity, quite energetic, um, different from the usual um, Emery scent that I know. So right away, I ordered this one because I want to try it out myself. So when I got it, I sent it. Yes, it's actually almost the same as the brochure when I first smelled the bottle. But when you spray it, it's quite different, especially on your skin. So the, the opening is quite of a strong plum strong plum scent the plum and dark berries in there are so dominant they're so strong i could really get that scent in there it's fruity but not sweet fruity but more of the dark berries scent but for some reason there is still that powdery scent in there the dna powdery scent from the original emery is still in here so i feel like the powdery scent really is the more of a signature of avon fragrances that's what i noticed they always have that powdery scent in their fragrances so it also has in here so first of the opening i could get the plum the dark berries plus that slight powdery scent in here then from that it would change into more of a soft creamy um feminine powdery scent i love that it becomes from being a strong plum scent it would turn into quite softer sweet scent so i could get the vanilla in there it's also it has the vanilla it has the amber it has the mask as well some of my favorite notes in a fragrance so the dry down i could get the vanilla but still the plum is still there so i love the combination of that berry um plummy creamy sweet scent that um it gives me i like the combination of the plum the berry scent together with the creamy um sweet vanilla scent in there it also reminds me a little bit of sofia vergara's love if you have smelled that perfume there's a little bit of that in a dry down it's it's creamy it's milky sweet with a hint of the berry scent in there i actually love the dry down of this perfume i like creamy creamy sweet scent and it has along with the berry in there but the berry scent is quite toned down it's not as strong as the opening it's just a little bit of a background of the vanilla scent in there after that it turns into a very light um soft sweet powdery scent it becomes skin scent already so i that's what's left on me for about um two to three hours so the lasting power is also not that long um, which i don't mind actually for avon fragrances for the price as well i think it's not that um bad so after the strong opening note it would quickly turn into you would get your sweet vanilla um powdery scent in there and after that it would quickly turn into skin scent as well so it becomes very very light very light um sweet powdery scent on your skin that would also remind me of a body powder as well you know those scented um body powder 
I believe most Avon fragrances they do have a body powder um body powder version as well. Like they do have Emery um powder as far as I know. Though I don't think I'm not sure if they do have Seduction or other Emery version, but they do have Emery powder. So I think they would also work well if you um use the powder and the fragrance. So I think those powdery scent in there. That's the same scent as I could get in here for the dry down. I could get a body body powder scent on the dry down which i also like as i mentioned i like powdery scent especially the scented powdery scent not the plain talc one so i find it a bit feminine i don't know they light um they're giving me that light feminine um clean um feeling of the powder i remember before um, when i was younger i used to put body powder around my um body after i shower and it's giving me that clean um clean refreshing feeling plus the scent i do love it that's what reminds me of this one or any um perfume with a powdery scent in there but this one has more uh, like um added scent to it uh, aside from the powdery it has that sweet um berry like powdery scent which is quite different from the other um emery perfume that i have tried i actually don't find the perfume seductive just as what the name suggests but for me it's more of a soft feminine scent Though the plum in there, the dark berry scent, is more of a mysterious, making it a little bit stronger in the opening. But the dry down, the powdery vanilla scent is more to me of like a sweeter, um, mature, feminine scent. That's what I could get. Also, the powder scent and the mask is making it more of a cleaner scent rather than a seductive scent. So that was Avon's Emery Seduction. So I hope you do like this video. And if you do, don't forget to click the thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel. I do um, perfume reviews, perfume videos every single day and occasionally some makeup and skincare as well. So see you next time on the next video. Thank you for watching.